Happy Wednesday, everybody. Hopefully you're having a wonderful day because I'm going to break your hearts with some news. Uh, Why Schwartz English Side has come out with an announcement. Cue the dreaded music. Dun, 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 dun. That's the best I can do in the morning. That's, that sounds like dreaded in my mind. Anyways, we got an uh, introduction of a restriction list aimed at maintaining a healthy tournament environment. Stay tuned to our social media channels for the full announcement this Friday, March 11th, 2022. What does healthy tournament environment actually mean? We're going to take a look at that. So going out here, there is a wonderful resource out there on the internet. That would be Weiss Tea Time. If you wonder what Weiss Tea Time is, are you looking for a deck list, tournament stats, spoiler translation, rule explanations, occasional opinion pieces, a magical girl contract perhaps, for anybody that loves Madoka, then you found the right place. Right? So there's plenty of things out here to go do, as you can see. Uh, before I show you what's all out there and what I'm going to show you today, uh, go out here to YouTube. You're already on YouTube, I guess, if you're watching this video. <laughs> but anyways, uh, Wild Wild Weiss actually did an interview with uh, the owner of Weiss Tea Time. So right here, we got Taya out there. So go out, check that out. It was a wonderful interview. Uh, so check out Wild Wild Weiss while you're at it. Like the other videos, uh, Weiss Tea Time as well actually does have a YouTube channel. Uh, I suggest checking them both out. If you like them, give them that like and subscribe. You know, the more the more you make them feel loved and all that, the more content they will keep making. So let's just try to, to spread the love around, okay? Anybody that's watching this video, you know, make sure to do that. Uh, content creators seem to like that. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna go back here. So what, what this is on my screen is Bro 2021. These were the stats uh, for what decks were played, which one got top eight, and overall. So you can see these are your top eight. I'm gonna scroll down to the, the comprehensive numbers, you know, like of what actually entered the tournament. But you can see top eight. Uh, we have Data Live, Kaigya over here, obviously Data Live taking half the pie. That's pretty huge. In the Europe side, we got the same thing, uh, minus Kaigya. Kaigya is uh, not taking uh, two pieces of, of the pie. And North America, uh, you can see over and over again, what I'm really, really pointing out to you here is we see Data Live over and over again, okay? So top 24, you can see Data Live taking a huge piece and overall. So down here on this chart, we have Data Live as a total representation. We have roughly 25%, Kaguya, Slime, Fate. And you'll see this time and time again, you have Data Live, Data Live. Well, actually North, North, and Latin America a little bit less when it comes to that with Data Live, but still, Data Live is the resounding like overall uh, deck that people are playing. So you can see that right there on the screen. So when you think about an actual healthy tournament play, Data Live is showing up in the majority of the actual games. It is topping eight the majority of the time. So. With that, they're they're going to enforce a restriction or ban list, and you don't you don't have both of them, right? Like it's not like you're going to be hit with both. As you can see, JP already has one, and what we have here is some cards get banned, some cards get limited, like you can only run a certain number of them, and some are choice restricted, which means you can only place, uh, you know, like you have to choose one of the three cards or anything like that. So. Uh, what we have here from Wise Tea Time, again, go ahead and check out the site. This is the Japanese ban list, restriction list as of March 12th. During that presentation, there was a chart on the screen, that, the recent presentation, that I was like, I have no clue what this thing says because it's all in Japanese. But that was actually an update to the restriction ban list. And what you can see here is there's going to be something at least meaningful then for why she wears English. And more than likely, it, we don't know if this is going to be an exact copy of the restriction list from JP, but at the very least, we all know that Data Live here should be hit. Like if Data Live is not on the actual restriction list, that would be the biggest shocker in a long time that this thing is going to be here. We also have Kaya Love is War. Um, on the JP side that got restricted. That was one of the things I've talked about as in like a buy or invest. You don't wanna, we didn't know if a restriction list is going to come out, but if it does come out, it's obviously going to hurt the overall investment because 
getting hit with a restriction or ban as with any game, right? Like a car gets hit, it's going to go down. The price is going to go down. And since we talk about prices here, uh, that's what we're going to be looking for. So uh, you might want to go out here, check out this list. I'm just going to just show you this list quickly. Is the order rabbit? Oh, Love Live Superstar we don't got. But there is a Love Live Sunshine over here. Uh, Simpho Gear, Kentai Collection, Bang Dream. So as you can see, there are a few Fate. So you got Fate on there. Uh, there was an SAO, but these for, for SAO 10th, which we don't have, so no worries. But go out here and Haruhi. We got some Haruhi over here, okay? So plenty of stuff that could be aimed at. Maybe even getting some stuff that uh, actually wasn't ever banned. I don't know. Maybe they do that to slime. Because uh, we know the, the English meta is different from the JP meta just because of like how people play and also the ban list and restrictions. So it'll be interesting to see. Thinking about that, I am going to be taking pictures of all of the possible ones I think that are going to be banned. So we got double rares out here, obviously terrible spirit Kermi. Just looking at this list here, there is a limit of two. There's our girl. Limit of two. You can only play two of these ladies. And uh, you know, you might not need three or four anymore. And because of that, there's gonna be more supply. Again, we have choice here as well uh, for these four cards. Uh, it should definitely hurt some prices, especially this lady right here if we get limit two. Uh, Kagias. Sama, Love is War, Supreme Bliss, Chica, K, and what was the other one? I think it was Supporting, I Supporting. There she is. I Bestowing Courage. There we go. Uh, so those are getting uh, choiced as well, if, if it follows JP. So it'll be interesting to see what actually happens with the prices. It's kind of funny because we got good news in a way. JP announced, right, like that we're getting Kaya set two and data live for season two and three and then now we have uh, an english restriction right we know those sets weren't announced for english but more than likely they should be coming here and uh, now we're getting hit with a restriction list for that so see what happens it could work out in, in, a, in a benefit it's going to get restricted and then uh, we'll get a set two of those things that'll power it back up uh, we don't know what's going to really happen with it until it comes out. Uh, Love Live, Sunshine. So I'm going to be taking pictures of all these, seeing where the, the price goes. Just be careful, like if you were investing in single cards or something. I think the overall booster box will be fine because uh, Sealed always does okay. It's going to be the single cards that are going to get get a hit, okay? Uh, next thing we got here is, well, if those are going to get restricted and they're coming out March 11th, then what does that mean? Uh, that means that this guy right here I heard was a, a really good set. So this could mean good things. It, oof, that's kind of funny. It comes out on March 11th. So you're getting Mishoku Tensei and you're getting a restriction list. Uh, they line up real, really nicely. So I imagine we're going to see some other sets get a pick-me-up because of it. And this one should do fairly well. Anyways, I gotta go. I gotta work. Hopefully you all have a wonderful day. As always, have fun, be happy, and... Don't spend anything outside of your budget. Have a good one.